Hello everybody! We return to Firm Bus Simulator. It's been a very long time and today we are not in one of their magnificent coaches. We are in fact in a classic BB40. I believe it's a Toyota. I'm back in December 2019. Boy, it's been a long time since we've been on this game. They gave this vehicle away. They added it to the game as free content. So you just go into your Steam. Just go onto your Steam page where, the, where your game is located. Go into the Steam store. Locate this. Click download and it will install it into your game free of charge. Plus one to TML Studios for that. Let's take a quick look at it. It looks absolutely fantastic. For some, for some reason it reminds me of the uh, the Scooby-Doo mystery uh, machine. I don't know why. We've got a snorkel there. Just on the left hand side. Can you see that? I don't know if we're expecting some deep water to go through in it. So let's just go and check in the uh, passengers. Now this is a custom, a custom job I've created because to get back into uh, into the game, I purchased the uh, the Netherlands DLC, which is a recent DLC add-on, retailing at the moment at seven pounds fifty. So you know, I thought, oh, that's not a lot of money to actually spend to actually get back into the game and uh, go to some places which I haven't been. And that and this is a recent um, release as this video goes out. It was actually released. December um, 2020 so it's been out approximately one month now so this small map DLC is quite recent as this video goes out we're not too late to the party on this one So, hello everybody, I'm your driver, the Wobbly Captain, seatbelts on please, I'm going to be taking you down to Amsterdam, and yes, I'm British, you've got a British driver today. Empty seats here, everybody's sitting on the, uh, on the opposite side. No social distancing? Of course it's COVID-19. How are you all getting on with this COVID-19? We're in lockdown here in the UK, so I'm thinking of playing this theme bus simulator quite a lot over the next week or so because uh, I'm going to be stuck at home. Can't go anywhere. There's one of the magnificent coaches on the left. quite noisy this uh, this vehicle is you probably noticed that I've had to turn the in-game sounds down just slightly because uh, it is it has got quite a noisy engine on it now if you're watching this and thinking he says buzz 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 he says buzz. He doesn't say buzz. We can't even say buzz. Um, we say buzz funny because I'm quite a unique person. I'm from Stoke-on-Trent and our accent is quite distinctive. It's quite strong. We're a, we're, we're a, we're a working class grafters area. Uh, renowned for its factories, heavy industry, mining and pot banks. And uh, we've got quite a distinctive dialect, which is uh, quite famous. So if you're wondering why we pronounce buzz the way we do, it's just the way it is here. It's quite normal for us, really. It might sound a bit bizarre to you, but uh, it's normal here.
So yes, we're back on Thurnbull Simulator. I spent the weekend setting this game up. Um, had quite an interesting time setting my steering up. This game, you've got to take the time setting it up. I'm trying to fine tune my PC to get the best out of the game. I still think this game needs a lot of performance optimization um, updates to make it um, run a little bit more smoothly. What I'll say to you is if you've never played this game before, the better your PC, the better this game will look. If you've got a high end PC, this game will look amazing. But if you've got a mediocre PC, don't expect an absolute fantastic looking game. Um, my PC runs AAA Gaming, Red Dem Redemption, absolutely fantastic, and games like that. But when I play this game, um, I do seem to suffer from performance issues slightly. And uh, I've got a love hate relationship with this game. I like the game. The performance side of it just does me edit <laughs> a little bit. And what I do actually enjoy about this game is the highways, the freeways. I love the freeway driving on this. It's absolutely um, portrayed, I think, in a good way. I haven't had any problems with the AI yet. I think I've got the AI set up to around about 80 to 85 percent in game at the moment, um, and I've not encountered any major problems as of yet. Bearing in mind, I've only just started this game and come back to it. I've not been in any of the uh, well. I've not been in all the major cities as of yet. So we are actually slightly over speeding, which will uh, which will go against our um, driving behaviour score at the uh, at the end of the uh, at the end of the game. But uh, we do need to get these passengers quite quickly down to Amsterdam, and they're probably regretting getting uh, getting on board. <laughs> With the with the wobbly captain as the driver. Now, of course, remember if you want to see more of this game on the channel, um, I'm actually playing it myself at the moment. It is a game I do actually like. I do enjoy this game. Um, smack the like button. Comment in the comment section below and. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to see more of this game if you haven't already done so. I do own quite a bit of the uh, content for this game. I don't own the Scania bus as of yet, that Scania coach. And I think there's a few other DLC that I don't actually own. Um, maybe I'll buy them and uh, we'll take a look at them. But uh, I don't yet own France. I'm hoping if I can get a hold of the France DLC, um, I'm hoping to in future videos cover this this Netherlands um, add-on DLC, and then uh, we'll head off into France and uh, drive around the France uh, region in the coaches.
like we uh, looks like we're slowing down. Don't want to smash. Run into did that car? Has that car just hit the back of that trailer? It looked like it was. It looked like it hit the back of that trailer on that truck. Not too sure. There's one of our flex buzz buddies just in front of us there. What I do like in this game, if you've been away from this game for quite a long time, which I have, what first off it has received quite a lot of updates. Um, I was I was looking at the update section on Steam, and it has received quite a lot of updates, obviously since it's been released. Um, I still think it would benefit from performance updates myself. My, that's, that's just my personal opinion. Um, one of the updates is you can act, if you hit the brakes too hard, you get the skid effect, which I think is brilliant. Now, in your let's say you're a truck simulator too, an American truck simulator. You can have 40 tons on the back of your truck and you can slam the brakes and you don't get any skid effect whatsoever. Um, they've actually implemented, put into this, on uh, one of the updates sometime, the skid effect. When I first played the game, you didn't have that, so uh, I quite like that. That's a plus one for that effect. Now I think we've warmed the engine up now on this on this vehicle. We're literally thrashing it down here. It's an excellent vehicle from getting from A to B um, quite quickly. We'll just pass our buddy here. Little peep and a little wave. We're going to beat you, pal. We're going to get there first. Did that car run in the back of that van on the left there? <laughs> right, we're stopping. What is this? I don't know Amsterdam. Um, that well. Let me, uh, let's have a look at this. If we can get the uh, the camera up in the air. I like the boat. Little boat there. Little speedboat, whatever that was that's just gone off. It looks like we we're on some sort of... Um, bridge crossing this is probably one of them that our buddy's caught us up with just behind us he must have put his foot down this must be one of the uh, famous landmarks I would presume they've uh, put into the game and as you can see we're waiting for the uh, for the bridge to uh, reconnect with the, uh, with the road section there. That's quite cool. Right, away we go. Come on, get going. We're in a rush. So this is the Netherlands DLC. I've actually lost my save game, so I'm practically starting again. I'm just glad it's kept my position on the leaderboards. I'm going to aim to try to get quite high up the leaderboards. Um, if you want to chase me on the leaderboards, send me a Steam friend request and then you'll see me on the leaderboards. Um, but I'm going to see if I can get in the top 1,000, maybe the top 500 again, or the top 800, something like that on the uh, on the uh, on the leaderboards in this game 
I've got the whole of Germany to go back and run through, but uh, I'm hoping possibly to get the France DLC and we'll run through the France DLC and uh, continue this Netherlands uh, DLC add-on first, I think. Don't forget guys, if you're still watching up to this point, underneath the, the banner on the YouTube channel, there's a section called Community. If you click there, I very often um, post things on there. It's a little bit like a forum for the uh, for individual YouTube channels. And one of the questions I recently put is, if I'm to continue this YouTube channel this year, what videos do you want to watch? Because from my point of view, I haven't a clue what videos you want to watch because we get very few comments on the videos and we get very few likes on the videos. But what we're getting is subscribers. We're growing steadily in subscribers. But I don't know what you guys are subscribing for or what you're watching, if I'm honest. <laughs> so let me know. Go to the community section just recently. If you're watching this as the video went that goes out, just recently I put a question what do you guys want to watch on the channel? I know the fishing videos are popular. Um, I personally want to play more of this because I do enjoy this game. For all its faults, mainly performance is my biggest gripe with this game. It's, uh, I will do some more videos of this. Go to that community section and let me know what uh, what videos you would like to see on this channel. So it looks like we're nearing our destination. Now, of course, this game does have, um, if you've never played it before, it does have seasons in. That's why we sort of got a winter effect um, going at the moment. Um, you can, of course, run, you know, in summer, spring, autumn, and as seen here, um, winter. For me playing this today, 
for me talking to myself in the mic. What is strange is I haven't got the radio on in the vehicle because the, all the vehicles have radios and um, you can listen to some tunes and uh, it's really good. I like, you know, I, I always have the radio on so it just feels bizarre today doing this recording, talking to myself about the radio, about the uh, radio actually on. Um, I don't put the radio on because I probably get uh, the copy a copyright strike on YouTube. But uh, if you've never played the game before, the radio feature on all the vehicles is is quite good. Um, a lot of all a lot of the switches, a lot of the dials, the handbrakes, the gear stick, and everything um, all actually function and work. Um, it's pretty good. But here we are. You leaps in Amsterdam. We've arrived. There you go. It's the first time I've been here. Amsterdam unlocked. So, that was my first look at this vehicle, the BB40, which is free content, by the way. Don't forget that it's free content. If you've not played this game for a long time, um, like I haven't. I was quite surprised that they gave this away for free and I like it. It's pretty good. Now how well did we do uh, economy side? We did quite well. Doesn't look too bad. Lots of greens there. Passengers transported plus 10. 11 out of 11. Very good. Service side. A lot of greens. Looks good. Traffic rules. Quite a surprise. We've got the greens. Driving behaviour is going to be the one because we were speeding. Yeah, we've got a couple of reds there. Safety, safety distance broken. Speeding limits. And uh, steering misbehaviour. Well, I expected that because we were literally thrashing um, that little minibus down to Amsterdam. So if you enjoyed the video, guys, smack the like button. I want to play more of this. I hope you guys want to see more of this game. And uh, I'll see you all again in another video. Hopefully real soon. Stay safe out there, guys. Oh, before I go, let me just check this here. Your ranking. Let's have a look. Because it has... There we go. There's the good old wobbly captain. Now, I haven't played this game for a long time. So, I have actually fell down the leaderboards by quite a bit there. There I am. 17 position, rank... 1,706. Now I'm going to be aiming to try and get back in the top 1,000 at least. Um, friends, let me just have a look. Yeah, I think I'm going to try to get Jimmy there. I think I'm going to chase Jimmy there. He's position 855. So look out, Jimmy. I'm coming for you. I'm going to take your crown, buddy. Uh, Railway Bobby, you often quite comments, oh, you go, you're going to have to pull your socks up and do some driving if you want to catch me. Um, because you've got a lot of driving to do. You're way down there. Way, way, way down there. You're not going to catch me. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. See you all again. Stay safe. And uh, have a nice day.